How much profits will Tesla make on Megapack and how will that contribute to Tesla's overall profits going forward to 2030? I'm going to tell you something. The word mega fits. Let's dive right in. Are you ready? Let's go. We start with a pessimistic version of the mega pack story where Tesla scales up to 1.2 terawatt hours of mega packs by 2030. We have declining profits per kilowatt hour. We start at $250 per kilowatt hour in profit and it falls fairly rapidly at a 7% rate a year down to $130 in profit per kilowatt hour by 2030. Starting from 2022, we have a 50% growth rate from 50 gigawatt hours that takes us up to the 1,281 gigawatt hours. In this fairly pessimistic scenario, Megapack delivers over $166 billion in profit in 2030. But actually, I think this is selling Tesla short. When you think about the volume of Megapacks that they're planning to produce and the volume of batteries they're planning to produce, Megapack is one of the primary places we're gonna see these batteries go. So let's look at some numbers where they deploy more mega packs, more gigawatt hours of batteries into mega packs. Really quick though, I'd like to thank the Vasa Law Firm in Sweden and all my Patreon supporters for helping this channel grow. Link to Patreon in the description below. T-shirts at elonbits.com, let's be less wrong. Link to that in the description below as well. In a somewhat more optimistic version of mega pack, we get up to 1.9, nearly two terawatt hours of batteries in 2030. We see, again, the declining margins, 7% falling a year, down to $130 a kilowatt hour in 2030. And this leads to $258 billion in profit in 2030. It's a pretty big number. This is a needle mover. This is the type of thing that's going to push Tesla's total profits up. This is gross profit. We're not at net profit yet. That's in video five of this series, breaking down gross profit to net profit. Next, we look at an extremely optimistic version of the mega pack scenario where Megapack grows so fast at 75% a year starting in 2022 at 50 gigawatt hours, that by 2030 it reaches 4.4 terawatt hours. Sounds like a lot, but well within reach of Elon's goal and where Elon and Drew think the energy storage market is heading. If most of the world is going to be running on solar and wind, the world is going to need storage to cover that at night and when the wind isn't blowing. Again, we have declining profit per kilowatt hour down to $130 in 2030, and we see gross profit reaching over $570 billion in 2030. This is a big number, folks. I looked at these numbers again, and I decided to try it a different way, and I modeled it where the curve goes up faster and then falls a little quicker at the top. So here we get to 1,500 gigawatt hours or 1.5 terawatt hours in 2026. The growth is much faster early. That sounds like a lot, but CATL alone is planning to reach 1.2 terawatt hours in 2025 of lithium iron phosphate battery production. So 1.5 terawatt hours is definitely not out of reach for Tesla to achieve this in 2026. I have the, the profit per kilowatt hour starting lower and falling. So the profit per kilowatt hour is actually less in this version of the model. You see though gross profit in 2026, this is important. When I did this model a second time, I came up with much bigger numbers in 2026. So if you see Tesla on an exponential curve, then you're gonna see the profit rise quicker early and then tail off later. So we see that here, profit has risen a lot more early. We get to $174 billion of profit in 2026. It continues to climb. And in 2030, we get to three terawatt hours and $283 billion of profit, which is important. But it's interesting to look at this a different way if you think Tesla's profits might grow faster earlier. We're gonna see how that matters in video five of the series when we get to the profits. And for an even more extreme version of this, I pumped up 2026 numbers to two terawatt hours. I increased the profit per kilowatt hour a little bit, and we get to over $300 billion in profit in 2026. And then we get to four terawatt hours in 2030 and over $500 billion of profit in 2030. We're gonna see all these numbers come together in video five in this series, but video four is next where we talk about RoboTaxi, which is a really, really big number, depending on how you look at it. So let's take a look at that. Video four in the series is next, or you can check out the other videos. Of course, please support this channel on Patreon. Check out the t-shirts, elonbits.com. And thank you so much for watching.